Hi folks, Peter Scott here for FairOaksandCarmichaelHomes.com and today we are dividing up Fair Oaks and Carmichael Homes. So this is the Carmichael Homes video for May 25, 2010. And to start us off here today, we have 5756 Hesper Way in Carmichael, listed at $150,000. It's a three bedroom, uh, one bath with 1,045 square feet. Uh, unfortunately, there are no other pictures of it. Uh, I believe this one is bank owned home there. And Hesper, I believe, is uh, north of Madison also. Been on the market for seven days here. So, next up, we also have a north of Madison house on Sapanor. And it is 5604 Sapanor Way. And it's listed for 165. And it's a three bedroom, two bath with 1,078 square feet. And this one is also a, I think this one's a short sale, as you can see right there. If you don't know what a short sale is, uh, email me and ask me, because it's important to know. If you're looking for a home, you don't know about short sales, it's something that you should really, really find out about, because it's a whole different ballgame than anything else we're looking at here. Um, and next up, again, we're still, we're North Madison again, 5461 Edgar Lee Way in Carmichael, listed at 169. And Edgar Lee's been a really active street the last couple of years, a lot of foreclosures, a lot of turnovers there. Uh, it's 1,400 square feet, a buck 20 a square foot, not bad at all. Uh, three bedroom, two bath, uh, been on market for seven days here, uh, unfortunately. Uh, no pictures of that one either, just this one. Uh, it's slightly occupied, and it's also a short sale. Uh, so we're skipping over here to 6216 uh, Waldo Meyer Court in Carmichael, listed at $170,000. Uh, this one looks a little bit better condition. Also, again, a short sale. Uh, it's a three bedroom, two bath. This one has some nice pictures still. Uh, this one happens to be my favorite. Tells you a lot about the house there. <laughs> That's a joke. Uh, but a uh, nice looking kitchen here, as you can see, has been updated. Uh, it looks like they've done a, you know, a good job. Uh, keeping the house up, uh, which a lot of short sales they don't. So, uh, looks good looking house for the most part. Uh, might be worth checking out. Uh, so over here, Marshall. Marshall's a great street uh, in between um, Lincoln and um, uh, and Fair Oaks. Actually, goes all all the way to Madison. Uh, good street, kind of a little more rural setting there. I'm betting this one is a fixer. It's an original 1950s home. Harvard floors, so I think this one's actually a uh, uh, probate sale again. No, it's not a short sale or REO. It just came on the market yesterday, at 219, 1100 square feet. Probably overpriced. Uh, you know, 1100 square feet for you know a quarter of an acre for 219 fixer. I'm guessing overpriced, but we haven't seen the picture on it yet. So next up is a root. I'm a big fan of root. I think root's a great street, uh, kind of over by Robertson and Mission North Park. If you know where that is. It's a four bedroom, two bath with uh, 2,006 square feet and built in 1976 for 219. So that's the same price and it's double the, <laughs> double the size of the last one. This one's also a short sale. Again, if you don't know what that is, um, ask me because it's important to know. So next up we have California. Most people know where California is. Uh, great Street over by the American River and uh, Ansel Hoffman Park. Uh, that's a good looking kitchen there. Look good looking house all around. Uh, this one's a uh, newer home, obviously. Let's see, uh, 1,800 square feet almost, built in 2002. So you gotta love that. Um, it's got all the nice uh, modern amenities. It must be just off of California, actually. Uh, next up, 6334 Parring Way in Carmichael. I'm a big fan of Parring. Uh, that's over in the uh, Barrett Hills uh, subdivision which is uh, kind of over by Stolwood, in between Winding Way and Lincoln. Uh, that area over there, where Barrett Elementary is, or Schweitzer, or Barrett Middle School, or Schweitzer uh, Elementary, uh, that place. It's a big lot, too, 0.7 acres. You know, tiny house at 1,300 square feet. So they're really, they're, they're trying to price it for the land here at $325,000, because it looked like it needs some work. Uh, that's, yeah, a very pretty picture. Up uh, 1821 St. Anne Court, uh, listed at 375, about 1,800 square feet, three bedroom, two path. Oh, and look at that, finally a pretty house. Isn't that pretty? Look at those floors, those are pretty. I like those floors. And I like the backyard. What's not to like about this home? Maddox Ranch, uh, Maddox Ranch is over kind of by Arden and um, 
to Mission Avenue, kind of the south end of Carmichael there. So I completely remodeled in 2009. We knew everything, huh? I might take a look at that myself. And up we got 5120 Infinity Court in Carmichael, another newer home built in 2005. Newer homes in Carmichael and Fair Oaks are a little bit more rare. I mean, certainly there are there are plenty of them. Um, but they just don't come for sale because mostly it's infill stuff, you know, someone tore down a home here or there was a house that had, you know, a couple acres and they subdivided and put a couple of new lots on it. So a little more rare when they come up. So this one's listed at 425. Uh, it's about almost 3,000 square feet, four bedroom, three bath, and it is a short sale, uh, which is uh, something to take note of. Next we have Wheaton Court in Carmichael, listed at uh, oh, $900,000, we'll call it. And uh, this one is not a short sale. It's a uh, regular sale. So uh, you're in the market for that. Inviting pool recently rebuilt. Five bedrooms, four baths with uh, 3,583 square feet. That is a fabulous looking home. <clears throat> oh, we got even more pictures. Look at that. And the pictures don't stop. They keep going. Look at that pool. That looks fun. Looks like a cold day for the pool, though. Huh. All right. And moving on to our last one. It's 1632 Kingsford Drive in Carmichael, listed for just over a million dollars. Four bedroom, three bath, with 3,002 square feet. Uh, another good looking home here. Uh, Kingsford is over by the river, also, down near the end of Arden. Great street, great area. And, uh,. Like this one also is in good shape here. So if you want to get all the updates um, about the newest homes, uh, the listings on the market, the newest videos, um, if you want to take take a tour of homes, uh, you can go to the contact me page, or you can go. To, we also have down below here we have our um, you know to take a home tour, or on the right you can sign up to get the. Uh, our, our, our weekly uh, e email newsletters with the new uh, newest listings and everything, the newest videos coming out. So, Ferox from CarmichaelHomes.com. Uh, get out there. Houses are going quick.